So, it's Saturday today, let's see what we go and find. So, first job of the day, get these parcels labelled up. Parcels are now labelled up. So, parcels are labelled up now and today is off to town as usual, that's what I normally do on a Saturday. Go around the charity shop, drop the parcels off, do a little bit of shopping in Sainsbury's, all the rest of it. So also, aside from that, I've got a few other bits and bobs uh, reselling related to do. So uh, yeah, let's get on with the day. Nope, no Lego today. So I'm just in Sainsbury's doing some food shopping before I hit the charity shops. Just had a look at the Lego, there is some reduced but there's not anything I can really see if it's going to be profitable um, a lot of the shelves are quite bare actually which is odd so I suppose maybe some resellers have already been in I'm not sure um, but yeah um, I think we'll hit the charity shops in a minute On the tongue. <laughs> I if that's worth anything. Eve Salawan. By name. I mean, of course. Ooh. Oh, it's in. Looks like it's Hugo Boss, but the tag's been whipped out. Boy, boy. Ooh. Interesting. So I'm about halfway done with the charity shops, nothing as of yet, I'm actually walking into like this random place, um, I don't even know where it is, it's like, at the, it's like at the side of town, like the main high street, the main high street's just over there actually, don't know whether you can see down there, but this is just like a weird, I think it's where all the lorries come, all the trucks come to offload things into the shop um, but yeah so I've not got anything um, from the charity shops yet as I mentioned in my last vlog my charity shops in my local town are really poor like really poor at the moment one person actually commented about like saying like make connections with the charity shops and stuff I actually did do that at some point and then the managers ended up changing the managers left and new managers came in and I've just not got to know the new managers as well and that is a great tip that is a good way of getting more stock um, but generally they just put things out too high these days um, in my local town so what I'm gonna do as I mentioned on the other vlog is definitely in the next few weeks go to a couple of uh, different towns bring you guys a little bit of fresh content in different towns as well uh, for obviously the vlog and um, yeah hopefully that will give me a fresh mindset and uh, help me get some more stock but I don't you know rely on charity shops obviously auctions are the main way i get stock um auctions are a brilliant way to get stock so i'd highly recommend doing those uh, you can get a lot of stock in a short period of time so yeah anyway i'll leave it there for this segment and i will see you in a minute as you can see the christmas tree is still up so we are done in town now, I've got to go to the lockup to um, get some more stuff for obviously processing and listing. Um, but yeah, didn't get anything from the charity shops today which is a bit annoying but yeah, they've been pretty poor recently so 
Um, as I said, we are going to go to some others a bit further afield in the future. Um, but yeah, I will see you at Malak Cup. So I'm back now having have having having haven't having not been to the lockup. I actually left my key here. Now the reason I don't keep my key on my key ring anymore is because I've lost two, yes, count them, two of my lockup keys in the last year, having them on my key ring. I don't even know how I've done that, but clearly I'm just really clumsy. Um so yeah, I leave the key here and then I just take it um when obviously I'm going to the lockup. However, I forgot to do that, so I didn't go to the lockup. Up, I thought, you know what, I'll just go back tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to do that. It's not a pressing matter. I've got some stock here to process anyway, so it's not an issue. Um, but yeah, bit annoying that I did that anyway. So um, yeah, I'm going to get some lunch now and then I'm going to get on with my day. So I've had lunch and now it's time for a couple of hours of kind of just boring uh, jobs on the computer really. I've got to do my accounting for December and also I've got to write down my auction lots for on Monday for viewings. Uh, generally probably just a couple of hours on the computer. So I won't bore you with all this stuff. I'll just speed this up a little bit and uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next segment. So it's about three o'clock now and I've done the accounting and also wrote the auction lots. I do need to do a bit more research into a couple of the auction lots though so I'll get that done later on today. Uh, just obviously as you can see I'm just out for a walk and yeah I've got a little bit of, uh, more stuff to do. I've got a bit of photography and stuff to do. I'm not going to pressure myself too much with listings today because it is a Saturday and generally on a Saturday I go a little bit slower than the other sort of six days in a week. I don't know why it is but kind of like the last six or eight months I've just started to do that um, I like for example I don't do any packaging on a Saturday it's probably the only day of the week I don't do packaging so um, yeah I just go a bit slower on a Saturday and it's kind of like my semi day off but I still like to get a few bits and bobs done so yeah I'll take you through the rest of the day with me I've not got much more to do reselling related but we'll see what else uh, springs up I've just done a little bit of sorting as you might have seen there. What I'm going to do now is just do the auction uh, lots. I just need to finish up a little bit of research as I mentioned earlier. Uh, just on a few of those lots, some of them, uh, the research I can actually do now because they're things like uh, Royal Dalton figures and stuff like that. The box job lots, what I'll have to do is obviously go to the viewing and look at those more closely because obviously I can't see everything in, in, the, in the lots uh, or in the boxes. Um, but obviously I'd say the, the single items, the, the items that are on offer in the cabinets, I can actually research them now. So it means that I'm, I'm obviously uh, spending less time um, doing research later on, obviously on Monday or Tuesday, closer to the auction. So with that being said, I'm going to leave it here for this vlog, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please do get a big like down below. If you have any comments, questions or queries, drop them down below. If you haven't already, then please do consider subscribing. And uh, with that being said, I will leave it there. And I will see you in the next one. So see you very soon, guys.